Brian Schifferling here with Edgewood College women's basketball coach Kaya Huff as the Eagles get set for the NAC tournament semifinals Friday night, 7 p.m. against Wisconsin Lutheran. Coach, we'll get into Wisconsin Lutheran, but I want to go back. We talked in the offseason, and the goal was always that next step was making the conference tournament, but you kind of got a sense with this team. They didn't want to just sneak in, get the five or six seed, and you guys said you took care of business, you get the number two seed. How were you able to reach that goal? Um, you know, last year we were the first ones out of the tournament. Um, we ended up with a three-way tie, and the other two got in and we didn't. And um, it was discouraging for us, and my kids were really bummed about it. But we had a long talk about our goals and what we wanted to do, and I made it clear to them that um, if you don't want to worry and if you don't want to you know, get nervous and get left out, then you have to dominate. And that was really our intention. Um, is that we didn't want any question to be left. If we want to be in that thing, we need to, we need to make it happen. So that's one thing that we really went um, into the off season planning on. And yes, we still wanted to make a spot, but we didn't want it to be in question. So um, that's a that was a goal for us to make the tournament. But as our year went on, and we kind of saw what we had, and um, you know saw where our season was headed, we felt like we could do more than just sneak in. Was there a moment early in the year, maybe it was in the off season, maybe a scrimmage, early game, whatever, where you knew this team could be really something special? Mm. We started the year with two um, away tournaments. Um, we went to Minneapolis and then we went to St. Louis. And um, the tournament in St. Louis, we won the tournament there. Um, and I remember on the way home, I was on the bus and I was talking to my assistants and just kind of thinking through the weekend and we had surprised ourselves a little bit and I remember I asked my assistants like are we like good you know <laughs> which sounds funny but um and they all looked at me and just nodded you know and they knew what I meant um just that we had really taken a step from where we were and we felt it coming home on that trip. Play Wisconsin Lutheran Friday night. Before we get into them, what was it like all week not knowing who you were going to play? You didn't know until last night. Um, maybe thought it was going to be Wisconsin Lutheran, but what is that like not knowing your opponent? Until not good. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like it. I'm a planner, and um, uh, I like to really plan ahead and be prepared, and so that's hard for me. I didn't mm -hmm. like that. We figured it would be them. Odds were in their favor. Um, so that was helpful, and we just played them. So, um, but that, it's, it's hard. It's hard when you don't know. Very familiar opponent. You just mentioned you just played them. I think defense would jump out when you talk about these two teams, number one and two in terms of scoring defense in the NAC. What can we expect to see on Friday night? I think it will be similar. Um, both of our squads are defensive-minded, and when it gets to crunch time and it's playoff time and it's must win time i think both of us are going to tend towards defense because we know that's something we can count on and um you know offense can come and go at times and so i think it, i would expect a lot more of the same um certainly from our end we're going to focus on defense we're going to focus on stopping what we need to stop and hopefully um, our defense will lead to offense now we want a big crowd here friday night so i want you to look at the camera promote this game why should people come out and watch the Eagles come watch us this Friday this is one of the most exciting sports seasons that's been around in a long time hopefully start of many to come and we need the gym packed when the edge dome is rocking it's an incredible environment to play in um, we experienced this last Saturday so come there's free pizza free pizza free popcorn for faculty staff as well uh, it's going to be the eagles and the warriors friday night at 7 p.m inside the tideware edge dome coach good luck thank you